Hey guys, what's going on? It's Steven and welcome back to another career mode video. Last video we read Dover, we ran in the back. Now we're going on to the tricky triangle Pocono. Now this track is, uh, they don't call it the tricky triangle for nothing, but first we need to go to the sh team management because ba -ba -ba -da, we can get a new shop and now i saw the comments some said chassis some said engine and i'm looking at both 10 tire grip but also 10 horsepower i think right now we need the horsepower more than anything so we're gonna do it nine races we all we won't have much left in the bank but i feel confident that we will be okay yes we're gonna do that there it goes we have officially started our next one and speaking of we can start building engines if we want we only have 29k in the bank so we can't do anything but the potential of what we're gonna have 60 55 62 i'll wait nine races for all of that all right let's check on the point standings just as a quick refresher junior has the lead with newman in the top five down to burden rounding out your top 10 and we are in 29th all of our sponsorship goals are 30th so we need to start looking at the number 30 more than ever rookie of the ward race went to kevin grupp the guy who caused the last caution good for you let's look at that rookie awards we're still 200 and something back anything could happen now on to pocono with a 53 overall car rating coming to the line the green flag wave the clock has started and this is all Pocono, what is there to say about Pocono? Um, it wasn't in NASCAR, uh, NASCAR 2005 chase for the Cup. I've actually been to this track. Not this race, but the uh, August race that we'll be returning to. The Pennsylvania 500, I actually was there in person. I'll tell a funny story about that when we get there. There's the tunnel turn, as they call it. And, as you notice, there's no turn four. And the newer, uh, new, uh, wow, I think just Pocono drifted. All right, hit me with your last place. Okay, so I wanted to slow down just a little bit more, but that wasn't that bad, I don't think. We'll see what this time. All right, anything but last. Hey, starting with a provisional will make it more of a challenge, right? 40th, but not 30th, so we're not going to get our sponsorship bonus. The MRN is live in Pennsylvania today at the Pocono Raceway for the Pocono 500. What can we look for on this unusual track, Barney? The corners here at Pocono can be absolutely brutal, and gear selection is crucial for those long straightaways. The drivers that'll do the best are the ones that can set their turns up correctly and slingshot out of them for that extra boost. Ryan Newman will begin the race in the top five in points. He just needs to keep digging like he has been. Sometimes when drivers reach the top five in points, they start to push themselves too hard on race day and wind up losing spots instead. I'm sure he doesn't want that. Jeff Burton will try for another top five finish in this one. You know, people get so concerned with wins. Me, I'll take consistent top fives all year long over a win. Besides, when you're constantly finishing in the top five, a win is just around the corner. The 56 car hasn't run well on his qualifying attempts at the speedways this year. Man, that's true. Maybe he likes having to pass all those cars on race day. I know I would prefer to start towards the front, and I'm sure he would too. But hey, he'll get there with some patience.
Anywhere but <coughs> Sorry I'm under the weather. <coughs> Anywhere but <coughs> Anywhere but less, that's where we wanna be, God. That took me a minute to get out, sorry, I am a little under the weather. Here we go. From fortieth. Anything can happen. Ooh, I thought I was gonna hit Ward there. Number 22 is still there. Careful. The 22 car is still there. Keep digging. All clear, buddy. Got one eye. Okay, we lost a spot. Okay, we didn't, but that worked. Thank you, Ward, for the assist. Well, in reality, we didn't go anywhere but backwards. We lost two spots, but you never know. Sorry about that, Brett. I didn't think I'd get that much of a run, but I did. There's the St Stan Baird. Okay, Let's see what we're gonna do here. Sorry, Stanton. Sorry. Hi, Mike. How you doing? What the fuck was that? What is going on? Oh my goodness. Oh, spots? Hell yeah, okay. I don't deserve any of those, but thank you for blowing up there, Sterling Marlin. I do have another enemy, though. A lot of these cars are going to pass me. As long as I, as long as I can stay in 30th, I don't care. Wow, that was a turn of events. I wish I would have uh, gone high instead, but you know. Nothing you could really do there. So one thing about this track is when they blow up, there's nowhere to go. Especially in the pit cycles. Anybody who's played this game knows that. Sorry about that. Hey, Robbie's still kind of our friend. Robbie, what are you doing? Man, I'm just dr sliding all over this place. Pocono slide. Ooh. Just got past Joe Nemechek for 20 for P25, so that's awesome. We're working with our buddy Kenny Wallace here. You know, I believe in this game you need a lot of shared draft, especially when you first start out, just to get going. Okay, that, uh, that went nowhere. Fuel We're only halfway on fuel. Oh, I think cars are pitting. I know they're just running a really weird line. Yep, some cars are pitting.
which is weird. That's probably the most smoothest tunnel turn entrance ever. Okay, that was smooth. The O one car is still there. Someone got by you. Let's go after it. Clear on both sides. We could just drive it in there pretty damn decent. All right, I think, uh, number one is still there. Well, none of the leaders have really pitted, I don't think. I think I'm gonna. Mm, I don't know what I want to do. I really don't know what I want to do here. Let's see what they're doing this lap. Some of the leaders are coming in together. Man, I almost drove that turn. Overdrove that turn. Okay, I think we're gonna pit next time by for sure. Cause this is halfway. Yeah, we're definitely going to come in this time. Definitely going to be a weird finishing order, I think. Coming down to pits, here we go. Why not? We will pit the damage. All right, crew, we have a decent car. Let's go. Right tire changer, you are on your last nerve by leg, by the way. Great job, guys. Great job. Let's go. Hey, we're 33rd a lap down. Okay, we're clear. But I don't think half these cars have pitted yet. This is just not what I want, though, is for something stupid to happen and I can't get 30th. Wow, that's race car things? I had never felt that before in my life. Okay. Now something stupid could happen. Ooh, this feels good. Ooh, man, I feel like I'm mastering that tunnel turn. I'm going to be excited to come back here. Especially if we have better equipment. Mm -hmm. E29, other cars are coming out of the pits. Number 32, it's down low. Hey, that's worth another spot. Keep digging. Clear. I'll take it. I mean, we still got a long way to go. And you never know what's going to happen still, so. I can't. Who is that? Is that Kevin Harvick in front of me? Is that Jimmy Johnson? It's Steve Park, neither. Number 32, it's up high. Okay, we're clear. The 32 car is inside. All right, Ricky, you passed me. Let's go. 
As all three of us nearly wrecked. Take me with you. No! Fine. I'll pass him myself. Ooh, not like that I won't. My goodness. Look at this run we got on park. Let's go. Let's go. Nope. Is it gonna like that? Number 30. And then I do that. I forgot. I was focused more on him than the turn. That wasn't the plan. Sorry, Steve. You're mad at me. I don't blame you. I just have a faster car and I want to go. Robbie Gordon, how you doing? Our somewhat friend. I think we could get him. Especially with two to go. Oops, sorry, Robbie. All right, here we go. Leader took the white flag. We are coming out of turn three to take it right now. I, I, I think we can get top 25 right now, the way it's looking. If, if we can catch uh, Kenny before this next turn. I don't know, though. That's a thing, so. I just got to run a good lap. Can I at least keep 26? Check her flags out, but it just won the race. Number 31 is still there. Be patient. The 31 car is still there. Look at that run, look at that run, look at that run. Let's go. Come on, can we get Johnny? I don't think we can. I don't know though. Dang it, twenty top twenty five, I'll take that. We're done. Any day. No. Yeah, I think we come back with a better ride. We have definitely a good car. The yellow flag didn't fly at all in this one. Whoa, that doesn't happen very often. It makes you pay a whole lot more for any mistakes. You don't have the cushion of yellow flags to get caught up. The 56 car has begun a new rivalry on the racetrack. Should be interesting next time they get next to each other on the racetrack. At this point, nobody wants to back down, and we could see some sparks fly. Unfortunately, we're out of time for now. Thanks for joining us. So long. We'll see you next week at the Michigan International Speedway. Oh, boy, Michigan. As you can see, we have more rivals than friends, but that's okay. Looking at the big bucks, we made some money. Both of our sponsors made us, well, gave us some money. Race winnings. Team, we only have 167K, but I'll take it. Let's look at the finishing results. Junior led all but five laps. The other five were Dale Jared to finish second, Rudd third, Stewart fourth, Gordon fifth, Johnson sixth, seventh is uh, Newman, Martin eighth. Ninth is Harvick and tenth is Jeff Burton. We are P25. Man, started 40th. Now we're here. Did we get an award? No award. Dang it. All right, time to take a look at the updated standings. Junior still contains the lead by 22 over Jarrett, Gordon, Harvick, Newman, Rudd, Martin, Stewart, Johnson and Burton 
all of them in the top 10. I think we might have moved up a spot, I would hope. Nope, we're still P29. But we finished good, I thought. Um, hopefully we could take that same setup to Michigan next weekend. That'd be great. Who won the award for, mo for picking up Ward Borton? I think he probably finished. I think he was one spot behind me or something. Getting really close in on Jamie. But I think that's that Chevy's leading the, the, the manufacturers. I almost said constructors, like it was F1. Next time we go to Michigan, appreciate everyone who's been around and hanging out. If you like the video, give it a thumbs up. If you're new to the channel, subscribe. You follow me, I follow you back. Until next time, I'll see you.